I am so freaking excited today for a couple different reasons. Number one, I got one of the coolest Ryobi tools that I've seen in a long time. I am super pumped and you're gonna love this damn thing. And the second reason is, is because we're doing something on this video today that we've never done before. We've invited one of the world premiere musical talents to the channel and they are going to premiere their newest music video for you. It's gonna be fantastic. Sit back, relax, get subscribe, hit that bell notification. Well, let's get this video going. All right, so you know that we're a tool channel. You know that we love those tools. What do we got today? Listen, if you're in the Ryobi, not Ryobi platform, I'm gonna tell you something. They came out with something that is extremely cool that I think many, many, many of viewers of this video, you're really gonna like it because they did such a good job. So what do we have? So this, my friends, is the new Verse audio speaker from Ryobi. So you're asking yourself, what makes this so much more special than something like this, a more conventional radio? So a conventional radio you take, you set it down, and if you walk away from the shop area that you're working in, or maybe you're out on the construction site or the office or whatever you're doing, you know, you can only hear this in one area, then you're not able to hear it in the other. And well, that's where the new Ryobi, not Ryobi, verse speakers come in so freaking handy. Now, you can buy these in a two pack, a single pack, whatever you wanna do. Now, of course, I'll leave a link in the description below for you to check these out, but I have four of them right here. Now, again, as you can see, there's four, and each one of these have their own, well, bat ray. But what do they do? Well, you guessed it, they all tie in to each other. Not only that, you can put each speaker 150 feet away from each other, and you got a 250 foot screaming Bluetooth distance connectivity. And even though we have four right here, you can hook up over 100 speakers together. Let me show you how easy and simple this is. All right, so when you go to hook this thing up to your telephone, your laptop, I don't know, whatever you're streaming from, you're gonna hook up a primary speaker, and this one here is gonna be our primary. So I'm just gonna hit the power button. Power on, primary transmitting. You hear that? Bluetooth connected. Bluetooth connected, automatically connects to your phone. Now if it doesn't automatically hook up to your phone, you just go under your settings, your Bluetooth, and then you look for Ryobi clamp speaker system. Once that's ready to go, check this out. All right, now we have three more set up, and, and you can make any one of these your primary speaker. It doesn't matter, just whichever one you wanna do. We're gonna turn this on. It's automatically going to connect to this. There's just a link button right here. Once you set it up one time, you're done. Hit it. Power on, searching for primary, secondary sync. It's already sank, synced, sunk. And then you go right here, sync, sank. What's Power. this at? And now let's do the third. Power on, searching for primary, secondary sync. They're all set up to this one speaker. So whatever you're playing from here, they're gonna play from every single speaker. It's real nice, like. Now here's something else that is really cool. Now you can see that red button or that red light, that's telling you that this is your primary speaker. Watch what happens when I shut off the primary speaker. Power, Power off. off. It shuts them all down. Again, it's real nice, like. Now I do wish that once you hit this button right here, they would all turn on. They don't, you would have to turn on just like we showed you before, but it's super simple to do. And maybe you don't need these in a room, so. I don't know, I'm talking over myself. I'm gonna say maybe you're doing like drywall or something and you don't want these on in a certain room, so maybe that's a good thing that they don't all turn on. I'm just letting you know they all shut off, which is pretty cool, it's gonna conserve your battery. I mean, uh, battery. Now, what else makes these so cool? Well. Right here. So just for an example, you know, I did a video on this Ryobi, not Ryobi fan not too long ago, and you clip it to wherever you want, and the fan, it blows that cool, cool, sweet, sweet air on you. Well, Ryobi, not Ryobi, decided we're just gonna put clips on every damn thing. So maybe I'm in the shop, and uh, I don't know, I want a speaker right here. And I want one on the other side of me, right here. And maybe now I'm on the other side of the shop, but I want one right here. And now I want one right there. So now you're working and your shop wants to listen to TRZ videos. Well, I got two right there. And if I swing around to the other side, well, I got them hanging right there. I mean, really, you can set them wherever you want. If you have a pool party, you know, you got something going on in your deck, your patio, and you can swivel this head like so. And you can also rotate it. So nobody misses out on that sweet, sweet TRZ video. Okay. so. The most important question you probably have is, what about the sound? I'm gonna tell you straight out, if you're thinking you're gonna get a big bass booming, boom, 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 these are not it. You got the little baby tweaker speakers in here. And this is where our world famous musician is coming to play for you. You see, I can't 
play music on YouTube because YouTube will shut down the video. They'll also shut down the video if you don't smash that like button, get subscribed, hit the bell notification, leave a comment, share this out. Anyway, I'm gonna play this video from the musician through these speakers. And the one thing I will tell you is being a musician myself is that I am able to pick up notes in songs. I'm able to hear things better using these smaller speakers than what I would a big gigantic radio. They actually sound very clean, very crisp. Let me show you without further ado, the world premiere video. Take it away. Don't let them lie, don't let them lead you astray. When you hear some other say, right over the wrong way. It's right over, no real me, no real me. It's right over, do you hear what I say? Say it the correct way is pronounced right away. Yeah, some others wanna lie, they wanna make you sound silly. But don't let them pronounce it the correct way. Pronounced right away. I hate TRZ's face. That was damn beautiful. So what did we learn today? Number one. That man has a beautiful voice. Number two, these things are really freaking awesome. They do sound pretty freaking good. I mean, again, you're not gonna get that crazy amount of bass, but this is pretty crisp, pretty pretty clear for what you're getting. You can spread these throughout the area. It doesn't matter if it's a workshop, a studio, you know, the work site. And, and I know a lot of people would say, that's the last thing I need on my work site is Muzak. Well, you're a crappy foreman. Let your people listen to some Muzak. The only other thing I will say is that you're gonna need a bat ray for each and every one of these speakers. You can't just like put one in here and they're all gonna run. So, you know, a 1.5, a 2AH bat ray, you can even buy these in the kits that come with the bat rays. So that is gonna be one downside. That said, if you're already in the Ryobi platform, I would definitely check these out because I think you're really going to like them. And you got that Muzak and that TRZ video audio just surrounding you no matter where you go. And again, if you have a pool party, you have, you know, a thing at your house, an event, whatever, you put this on and you can clamp them basically anywhere or just set them straight down on a table or whatever. I just think these are really, really cool. I think they did a really good job. You even got a little handle on the back right there. And uh, you know, with the swivel and the adjustments and uh, I am really excited about these. But I wanna know what you think. Leave me a comment in that sweet, sweet comment section below. I love hearing that sweet, sweet feedback. And again, if this video has helped you in any way, listen, YouTube don't like power tool and tool reviews. They don't push these videos out unless you help the algorithm. So please, I ask you, smash the like button. I hate asking you. I hate asking as much as you hate hearing me ask you. Smash that like button, share it out, get subscribed. It is truly appreciated. And if you like this video, I got more for you right there. We'll be back with more videos soon.